I'm Dan Ackerman, and we are here taking a look at the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Carbon. Of course, a sequel to last year's X1 Carbon, which was a sequel to the year before's original X1. Uh, Lenovo says this is the lightest 14-inch laptop on the planet. I'm inclined to agree. It's a hair over three pounds if you get the optional touchscreen, which you should. It's a hair under three pounds if you don't. Uh, one of the great upgrades this year is an optional 2560 by 1440 screen, the same sort of better than HD screen that you see on something like the uh, MacBook Pro with Retina Display or the Toshiba Kirabook or even Lenovo's own uh, IdeaPad Yoga 2 Pro. There are two other things that make this new version notable. Uh, one, they've upgraded the touchpad so that even though you still have that Lenovo track point in the middle, you don't have the big buttons on top of the touchpad anymore. All the buttons, top and bottom, are just sort of built in click pad style. And they've made a couple of changes to the keyboard. I still love the Lenovo keyboard, best in the business. Uh, feel-wise, but they took the backspace key and kind of made it split a space with the delete key. I found that very distracting. And over here, the caps lock is now a home and end key. Good luck finding those if you're trying to touch type and navigate your way around a page. Possibly the most notable new thing is what they call an adaptive keyboard, which is really just this strip up here that replaces the function key row. Uh, it, it's backlit. It has about four different modes, and depending on what app that you open, whether it's a web browser or Skype or an Office document, you'll actually to get a different row of functions, and that's actually kind of a cool idea, and it works well in the application that it works with. I'd love to see a future version maybe letting you, let's say, customize your perfect function key row uh, and tie it to a specific app, but they don't have that yet. Of course, all this does not come cheap. Uh, this is the premium end of the ThinkPad line. Starts at about $1,400, bucks, goes up to $2,000. I've got a good in the middle, that $1,679 build. It has a Core i5, 8 gigs of RAM, 128 gig hard drive, and most importantly, that upgraded 2560 uh, by 1440 touchscreen, which I think is, is really the big selling point here. I'm Dan Ackerman, and that is the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Carbon.